Hey, so we actually moved upstairs here at Wall Street Cafe. If you guys are watching earlier, it's right here, downtown Suffolk, Washington Street. And you're not only going to get a great cup of coffee, great food, but you're also going to learn a little bit. You're going to learn how to invest. You're going to learn about business. And you're going to learn about black history and some of those successful black neighborhoods, black Wall Street in the past. And we have Danita Hayes here, who is one of the owners. And I do want to ask you about that really fast. Is You know, just the wall downstairs that we were showing, and the whole concept of this business. What's this all about? So it's all about community. Basically, as you can see here, Dominic is from Saratoga. In Suffolk, I'm from Norview. And so as the people come in, the people from these different neighborhoods, when they come in, they sign the wall. We want the community to know that, you know, even though this was our vision of the Wall Street Cafe, you guys are the heart of the community. And we just wanted to make sure that we um, show them that it's not just us, it's community. It's mm -hmm. everybody here who signed the wall. We're standing on the backs of these people to be able to make this vision come to fruition. And so it's all about community. That's what sets us apart. You know, we're here to educate the community about generational wealth, the stock market, real estate. We're advocates of entrepreneurship. And we just want the community to know that it's not just us, but they too have a piece of this pie as well. And as a successful black businesswoman yourself, what do you think seeing someone like you would mean to maybe a younger person who, who looks like you and you know already maybe has an idea of how much they can achieve and then they see where you're at? I mean, what do you think, what would that mean to you? Maybe if you were at a younger age and you saw someone like yourself? Yeah, I mean, because I have seen um, other black women <clears throat> growing up. There were women who, I would even say Alveda Yule. She was someone that I looked at and said, you know what? I want to be on the news one day. You know, if she can do it, I can do it too. And I think that when black little girls see me, they see, you know what? I can be a business owner. I can own a real estate company. I can own a cafe. You know, I can own an investment real estate company. And so it just gives them hope that there's more out there for you. And I'm happy and excited ex that God gave me the opportunity to be a vessel um, for that and to be that inspiration for young girls. During the COVID-19 pandemic, nonetheless, I mean, this is you guys are opening a brand new business during a difficult time when so many businesses out there have closed. Yeah, we definitely, you know, as I said before, we just basically put our heads to the plow. We didn't get distracted by what was going on in the world, but we knew that this was a vision that God gave us and he chose us to uh, make it happen, to manifest it. So we had no choice but to seek him for direction and just to to do the work we had to put in the work. What I Danita Hayes, thank you so much for having us out here today. I really appreciate it. Owner of the Wall Street Cafe with Dominic Epps, who, if you guys were watching, watching earlier, you saw that. Again, uh, Danita's from the Norview neighborhood in Norfolk. Dominic's from the Saratoga neighborhood in Suffolk. They want folks from these neighborhoods to come and sign this wall. And just, you know, just to, as a symbol of all the support, they've gotten to open this new business. And if you're not from here, you can also sign this wall, yeah. which I just did. Oh, there I am, right there. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, come here, come out to Wall Street Cafe on Washington Street, just not even a block away from Main Street here in downtown Suffolk. Leave your mark here. Learn a bit, little bit about investing. Learn about black history and all that went into making this business what it is. It really is truly amazing. Great cups of coffee as well. I mean, like, you know, it's a coffee shop, right? You got to make sure you have a good cup of coffee and good food, too. So really excited to be here this morning. And we have more information on our website, WTKR.com, if you want to learn more about the Wall Street Cafe. For now, though, we're live in Suffolk. Anthony Sabella, News 3.